Ladies and gentlemen, your host for the 72nd Annual Academy Awards, Billy Crystal. I just wanted to make sure I got here. That's why I had the LAPD plant me here. So, all right, edgy. <clears throat> That's a speeding ticket for me. Well, welcome to the Oscars, or as ABC likes to call it, Regis's Night Off. <laughs> it's a wonderful night for Oscar, Oscar, Oscar. The five films nominated for Best Picture are... Yep, it's the feel-good death row movie of the year. Green Mile is the place to be. Tom Hanks is there, but he can't pee. Then, as he walked his late night watch, the bill talk dark and handsome guy grabbed his crotch. Bright lights! Last rice, sponge dry, you fry. Don't get me wrong, but it was a little bit long. Three hours, tell me why. Green Mile! You know, thank you. Vice President Gore loved the Green Mile. He just wanted to know why the electric chair couldn't have been solar. So. We have a lovely crowd here tonight, so many new faces. Some just new eyes, but a lot of new faces. <laughs> Looking out of the crowd, some exciting stories tonight. Great Richard Farnsworth sitting right over there. Welcome. <clears throat> For the, the straight story, which is the story of Dr. Loris Lessinger. <laughs> Couldn't be here tonight. Couldn't get anyone in town to do a hair and makeup. Also, <laughs> great performance, Hillary Swank. Mm. Mm. Who is nominated in the new category, best performance by a leading actress with a supporting part. That's a new, new category. <laughs> and we could not have a show without the man himself who found the missing Oscars Willie Fulgear, sitting right over there. <laughs> hey, no, Willie. <laughs> Willie got $50,000 for finding the 52 Oscars. It's not a lot of money when you realize that Miramax and DreamWorks are spending millions of dollars just to get one. <laughs> so welcome, Willie. Another great story this year was the Sixth Sense and the success of the great young actor in it, Haley Joel Osment, who's sitting right over there. Hey, Haley. <laughs> Welcome. Eleven years old. God, I've had movies in development longer than that. <laughs> Haley, this one is for you. People. Kids who see dead people. Are the spookiest people in the world? You're 11, having chats with folks in heaven. So if you see my Uncle Doug, tell him I didn't pull the plug. You see things that ain't there, like Bruce Willis. With hair, you're in the sixth sense. You were so great in the sixth sense. You may go home with Oscar and with Cher. I am gonna go and 
in 60 minutes, I am gonna go in 60 minutes, I am gonna go and spill my guts in 60 minutes, just in 60 minutes I will tell them everything I know! I just hope that they put it on the show! Of course I'd hate to risk my life by saying that I'm gonna be on 60 minutes and then tuning in to find out I'm not even there! It's just Mike Wallace and an empty chair! And still I can't keep it in, so I am gonna tell the truth and say you've done it! I just pray to God they had the guts to run and someone held on you and he has got to do it, even though I know I've got my faults! I know everybody there thinks I'm a loony, they have got their nerve! They hired Andy Rooney! And really, Molly Safer, I'm gonna sing the 60 Minutes Waltz. You can tell the big chats up at b and I've got some information that will trouble you. Spare us from your fiction. You know cigarette addiction is the thing that fills your vaults. I don't care if they all say that I'm a wacko. Watch this little wacko bring down big tobacco. I'm a fight of the insider, yes, and I just sang the 60 Minutes Waltz. I'd like to sing a song about Mike Kane. He never met a script that he didn't like. Everybody, Kane. He's made a lot of movies. First Alfie, then he kept on making more. He won for Woody Allen. But why'd you have to go and make chores for? How many movies can one actor make? You'll make one in the next station break. Hey, tonight you're dressed to kill, and you may be going home to Prince of Maine. I'd gladly cross a bridge too far to be the actor that you are. You're such a classy movie star. Hey. He just turned 40, but he digs a teen, loves to shower, never gets clean. The guy next door is a closeted marine. Ah, uh, that's why this beauty is a champ. There's always roses all over the floor. He gets his reefer from that nutcase kid next door. His wife's adultering and looking for more. Uh, that's why this beauty is a champ. He's now a free, fresh, high hamburger selling cat. He's lifting weights. Ooh, he's throwing plates. She fled. He's dead. It ain't a feel good. But boy, is it great. Uh, that's why this movie could win eight. It's time for Oscar to take center stage. This guy's had work done. He never shows his age. 